and deter new and emerging crimes. Prosecutors are the gatekeepers of the criminal justice system. They are the most visible custodians of the rule of law and the guardians of public interest in the enforcement of accountability for criminal offenses. The expectations which fall on the prosecutor are heavy. To discharge them, prosecutors must enhance the credibility of the institution and overall legitimacy of law enforcement by fiercely asserting their independence, consistently demonstrating fairness and being guided solely by the law. Let me repeat, guided solely by the law. I understand that prosecutors occasionally come under immense pressure for other political considerations. I want to encourage you that you have an opportunity as a prosecutor to make history, to build an institution that can transcend your own term in office by not succumbing to impunity, by not kotoing to political convenience, but standing up for the institution that you represent and ensuring that prosecutions are independent in word and in deed. <clears throat> I say so without minimizing the working environment that many of you work under. Sometimes you have huge challenges. Sometimes you have huge and uh, monumental um, customers, if I may say. And sometimes it is um, overbearing in an office. Uh, I was listening, for example, yesterday, and that's why I know the job of a prosecutor is difficult. I was listening yesterday to one of our politicians who was alleging that members of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission went to his house. And he's telling this story five months after the act. And he's volunteering this information laced with insinuations that the officials had gone there for something he has not disclosed. It begs the question, if it is true, what were these officials doing in your house at your invitation? Being a candidate, how did you end up inviting officials of an independent body to your house? It also begs the question, you had an opportunity to bring up this evidence of alleged bribery before seven judges of the Supreme Court. You did not. You have instead chosen to take this big announcement to a political rally. I can see that the job of a prosecutor is really difficult if you have to deal with such. However, the government of Kenya remains committed to promoting public confidence in constitutionalism and the rule of law by respecting, defending, and upholding the independence of national institutions and eradicating undue influence and weaponizing tendencies. We are committed to promoting an ideal environment for the revival of prosecutorial zeal guided by national values and principles of governance and underpinned by sound graphs of constitutional mandate. I therefore affirm that the government of Kenya will deliver on its commitment 
to allocate adequate resources to enable agencies throughout the governance, justice, law, and order sector.